Hey guys, BrickWizard59 here today coming at you with the very first update of my newest LEGO mock. And this is Jabba's Palace. So, if you've been following my channel, you know that I did build a huge 10 foot Tatooine mock out of LEGO. And now that that mock series is over, and the mock final mock video um, has been filmed, I am going to be tearing it down. So sadly, I can't really keep it because there's too much, uh, too many valuable parts and a lot of money spent. So it would really go to waste if I just let uh, rebuild the mock and let it gather dust. Plus, I want to get on to new mocks. And of course, I can't just keep on buying pieces that I don't really have the money to. So whatever parts I have, I have to reuse. So I will basically be now using the mo uh, parts from Tatooine to build um, a brand new mock. And for those of you who have not seen Tatooine, I'll put a link in the description below to my entire building series as well as my final mock video, so check it out. But um, in terms of my new mock, I will have a detailed video on what that might be in a, in a bit, as I do I definitely have a few ideas, like a shopping mall, maybe a baseball stadium. So there are a decent few ideas, and I will probably make a video and even have your guys' say um, in what my next mock should be. But at the same time, I do want to have a bit more of a physical um, part of tattooing that still remains. Um, so, you know, I, a physical uh, piece that I can kind of remember tattooing from. So I will be probably saving one, maybe two base plates from my favorite buildings. Um, and I'll be dismantling the rest. But also, I'm going to be building a big Lego Jabba's Palace. And this is going to be a bit more to scale uh, compared to the Lego set. So once again, I'm loosely basing it off of this Lego set here, which is seen right there. Um, but I'm pretty much, like I'm basing a little bit of the design off that, but the overall look, it's going to be quite different as um, I'm going to do a lot more accurate. Because here's the problem, when you look at Jabba's Palace, there are various different ways it's uh, being portrayed. For example, in the Clone Wars, it has a completely different design than it does in the Return of the Jedi. And then in the Return of the Jedi, there's also like small diagrams and things that are different than Return of the Jedi. So I'll basically be kind of combining all those together and I'll have again images of those on the screen. But I'll be com kind of combining uh, all the, like, I'm gonna pre pretty much make a Return of the Jedi styled Jabba's Palace. So basically this is gonna be huge. Um, for example, this is the part of the first building. Now this building is actually the entranceway. So I'm kind of modeling this off the set. So this small building over here with the tower on top. So this small building here, which is about what? So 10 studs wide. Uh, I am making in this in my mock and it's going to be uh, about 24 studs wide so it's almost two and a half times the length of the regular um, set and you could see it with R2D2 and C3PO I have in terms of scale and so this is basically how it looks so here we have the entrance way which moves up and down and then to make it more of the round structure I ended up adding these half cylinders which I absolutely love those look amazing and then of course to kind of break it up as if you've seen basically the tower kind of it, it goes from a large building into more of the tower um, which probably will be on the top so I ended up making it uh, diagonal here uh, with these diagonal parts to give it a bit more of a smaller look here on the top so it's like uh, forming into the tower and then these studs here are for the gun emplacements so in the set you have that gun right over there I will be including three of those so that's actually more accurate to the actual Jabba's Palace here here and here and I think that looks really nice um, here's a better look at it I love the rounded part it looks really nice gives it a bit more of that look that Jabba's Palace does here's the side I have some windows and here's the interior which is a bit dark but there is the door in the back you have your entranceway into a bit of a hallway here and it'll probably be around this big the whole way on top of which I'll probably have another small room like this and um, I'm not completely sure what I'm gonna be putting in this room I probably will just put the prison where like Han and Chewie uh, like were held 
Um, and then here in the bottom is where the entrance is. And I'm going to maybe, if you remember in the movie, uh, C-3PO ends up like when he comes into Jabba's palace, he kind of, that little creature kind of thing attacks him from like a cell. I might do something like that, I'm not sure. Um, but there's a look at that. Um, and then here once again is a look at the other side. And you can see I did add these diagonal pieces on the back to kind of complete that like tower type of look. And I'm really happy with how that's turned out. Now this here I'm not as happy with. This is a tower kind of so I'll move this out of the way. This is like my basic tower thing that I'm thinking of putting on top like how they have in the set where this part is on top. But again, I'm not too happy. I, I, I tried just making a rough tower and um, putting it on top, this one, but it does just doesn't look good. Plus in the actual movie, uh, the tower is usually like, sorry about that, but the tower is kind of like in the back, like, seen kind of like in the back of um, the um, palace it's kind of like its own building and uh, the entrance way actually has a bit more of a kind of like dome on top so I might try and make some sort of dome piece I know like those planet series I might add like one of those like domes on top um, and I think that's kind of what the actual accurate Shabbos palace will be so I'll probably add that on top um, and I mean other than that I will be uh, coming at you with updates on this whenever I can. Again, this should be a bit more of a faster mock as I have a lot of tan parts already, as you know with Tatooine. Um, the only parts I probably will need to order is probably these half cylinders. And I'm really thinking, because this tower just doesn't look nice at all, um, I'm thinking of replacing these pieces with the half cylinders. I think that'll look really nice. Um, so I probably will have to order those and then order um, this tan, a dark tan brick of these for um, the actual palace and so there you go that's a quick uh, update this is the first update of this mock stay tuned um, probably in the next update I want to have this uh, uh, the tower done or this main portion here uh, entrance way done maybe have my tower done and start on the main palace which is probably going to be again in terms of scale it'll be what two and a half times what it's seen here so it'll be two and a half times of this size um in the set and actually this set i'm pretty sure is about like a couple studs larger than this tower so it's going to be huge compared to that set um but there you go and once again sorry one last thing i will be adding rock work on the bottom so that's going to be also very cool but there you go that's it uh, this was a bit of a rather larger update i just wanted to introduce to you the project and show you what all i have so far so stay tuned for more updates coming very soon. This is Brick with 59. Thank you so much for watching. Definitely give this video a like if you're excited for this mock project. And stay tuned for more updates coming soon. This is Brick with 59, and I'll see you all next time.